channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Tristina and I post mommy and lifestyle videos two to three times a week for you guys. I love decorating, cleaning, basically everything that has to do with being a homemaker and a mom. If you are new here, it'd mean the world to me if you'd press the subscribe button, become part of our YouTube family, and comment down below and introduce yourself so that way I can say hi to you guys. I love getting to know you guys. I've made so many different friendships through YouTube that I am so grateful for. Today we are going to be doing what might be my last decorating video of 2020 before my Christmas home tour, which is gonna be next Thursday. So that is coming up super quick. I'm really excited to share with you guys the whole house I'll put together for Christmas. But anyways, today we are gonna be decorating my hot cocoa bar for Christmas 2020. I always love doing this with you guys. Outside of like the tiered trays and the porch decor, I think the hot cocoa bar is my other favorite decorating video. I think that the hot cocoa bar was one of the first decor videos that I started doing when we first got our house um, two and a half years ago now. Or this is our third Christmas in this house, so it was 2018 that we got our house and I think that the hot cocoa bar is one of the very first videos I started doing so I'm really excited to share today's with you I love watching how my decor like progresses and changes year to year and this year is way different than that very first year hot cocoa bar that's for sure so without further ado we're just gonna go ahead and jump right into this so I'm just starting off by wiping down my windows with my Grove Collaborative Glass Concentrate. And then I'm going to go ahead and start hanging garland around my window. This is my first year ever doing garland. I went ahead and picked up these command strips. They hold up to four pounds. And these have worked perfectly for holding it and not falling down, which I was struggling with beforehand. So since I've never actually hung garland before, it took me a few tries to get this down. Um prior to this video, <laughs> but I did figure it out and the command strips work really well. So once I get that up, I'm just going to go ahead and fluff out the garland that way it doesn't look like, you know, super chintzy because this garland was only $9.99 from at home on Black Friday. It's a nine foot garland. So I went ahead and folded up the ends to kind of make it shorter and just fluffed it out to try and make it look a little bit more high quality. Yes, every time the snow is falling down And it is cold outside We gather around the fireplace And no one cares about guests I picked up this hot cocoa sign from Michaels last year and I fell in love with it and I still love it this year. So I went ahead and put this in the same spot actually that it was in last year as well. It fits perfectly in the spot above my window. So that just goes so great there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and wipe down my counter with my Iowa Pine Mrs. Meyer spray. Um, I always tell you guys this, my Grove Collaborative link is always in the description box. You can get a free five piece set if you click on the link and make your first purchase. Now this shelf I got from Hobby Lobby a couple years ago now, but they still have it. If it's something you're interested in, make sure you get it when it's 40% off or else it's pretty outrageously priced in my opinion. But I do love this. I always switch the spot out for either this shelf or my tiered tray. And for the hot cocoa bar, I love to use this shelf. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and start decorating. Before I put anything into containers, I'm just kind of putting everything out to see where I like it and how I like it. So um, a lot of this is from Target. Everything is from the Target dollar spot other than that little Santa mug is from the Threshold brand. And the vintage peppermint Santa tin is from Michaels this year as well. I picked up these sprinkles from Walmart. I think they were like $2.99 a piece or so. And I just went ahead and took off the wrapper because the bottle's super cute. And then these little signs are from the Target Dollar Spot last year. They were only a dollar last year and they fit perfectly into these little shelves. This Christmas I had completely forgotten that I had got this little hot cocoa towel by the Magnolia line at Target. So I decided to put that draping over the corner over here and I really love the way that it looks. 
But at this point, I have everything mainly decorated, so I'm going to go ahead and start kind of filling things in. So I picked up these little mini snowflake marshmallows from TJ Maxx, and then these bigger ones are from Target. And then my mom got me these chocolate stirring spoons from the Dollar Tree, actually. So I'm just going to go ahead and kind of layer everything into this jar that has the candy canes on it. I'm just starting off with regular marshmallows to kind of fill it in since the little ones wouldn't fill the whole entire jar. And then I'm adding some mini candy canes to kind of go with that candy cane theme. And then I put the snowflakes around the edge of the jar and add in more candy canes and also the chocolate stir sticks as well. Christmas, Christmas, I typically just go for some Swiss Miss hot chocolate. I'm not fancy with my hot chocolate, so I went ahead and just put the packs of hot chocolate into the tin. That way it's super easily accessible and kind of like, you know, it's all just kept together, which just makes life a little bit easier. I almost forgot about these adorable little stir sticks that I got from the Target Dollar Spot a couple years ago. I love these. I don't let people actually use them because I love them for decoration. And then I added just a few other little pieces that I had to kind of fill in the area. And then these Target Dollar Spot um, bulb lights, I'm obsessed with them. I have them all around at my house. I actually ended up putting it up on the garland, which you're going to see here in a second. This in Christmas times. decorating right I hope you guys enjoyed today's video I hope that you maybe got some inspiration for a hot cocoa bar super simple as you guys saw but it's also still functional while looking super cute in my opinion so I hope you guys liked today's video don't forget to give today's video a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it and don't forget to press that subscribe button it means so much to me when you guys become part of my YouTube family I'm about to have a cranky baby who's really mad that I took it down at the ring light so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye my heart.